It was May 14th. Like many other times, I was just doing the laundry. My daughter Alexa had a soccer game the next day, so her uniform was in the dryer. When I started folding and putting the things away, I realized something was missing. The socks. One sock from each pair was gone. I searched everywhere. The washer, the dryer, anywhere I could think of. But they were nowhere to be found. We lost a game because I didn't have my lucky pair of socks. I have to carry that goat for the rest of my life. For the rest of my life. The rest of my life. Yes, this is absolutely a global phenomenon. On average, people do their laundry once a week, and one out of three people are likely to lose a sock. The funny thing is, is that this is not the first time this has happened. Almost every time I do the laundry, the socks almost always go missing. Are the socks really lost? or have they been taken? Back in my day, we... Back in my day, we used washboards and hanger lines and nothing went missing. But now we have all these new fangled machines and everything's just going downhill. How do you feel about missing socks Wait, this is about socks? No! My grandpappy, he started a sock company. I mean, nowadays sales have never been better, but still... Who is behind all of this? There are many different types of socks, and that's what makes the sock industry so successful, and this, this country so great. You didn't answer the question. Hmm? This is a government conspiracy to make us have to buy so many socks that we forget about what we really need. Gloves! You know what I think? I think the government's involved in all of this. Stocking up on our socks, and they're saving them for some kind of weird, twisted experiment. Scientists, including myself, have been researching this issue for years, with no progress in unveiling what is causing this constant disappearance of the apparel. Who cares? I don't even do my own. Yet, there are many who don't understand the severity of this problem. I'm missing socks. When I was but a girl, I fell. Oh. On my wedding day, I I wore socks, and I had those socks for fifty years. Now I can't find them anywhere. You know, I truly feel terrible for sock owners because their single socks lose their soulmates, and that's an unparable. It's just so frustrating having to buy pairs of socks every week. You know what? They can't get me. I don't wear socks. Well, what would we need socks for? Can I go now? I know who you are! The government can't control me! Rest assured, action is being taken to alleviate this gravitating issue. We're done. We have barely scratched the surface of what can be unveiled.
This is going on the blooper reel. And yet, there are many people. <laughs> Sorry. Can I go now? That's terrible. Do it again. Where to be found? If I do that one more time, I don't really like that one. Look really sad. <laughs> Scientists include <laughs> Science. Sorry. Oh Scientists including myself. <laughs> Why did you laugh? I'm smiling again. Oh my god. Should we come back to you for a day too? Boom. I I truly feel terrible for song owners. And I forgot the rest of the time. <laughs> <laughs> yes, this is absolutely a global ph wait, I feel like that was so distracting. Yeah, that car was so loud. <laughs> <laughs> I feel terrible for single for, I'm sorry. For single people. Because they need a life partner. <laughs> 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 Who cares? I don't oh, do my thing. Oh, yeah. I, I was practicing. practicing. <laughs> <laughs> yes, this is absolutely. That was way too much excitement. Yes, <laughs> yes, girl. Gloves. They want us to be so distracted. Was was that bad? I'm no, sorry. no, that was fine. <laughs> you were fine. <laughs> <laughs> and let it go. 